administration has announced a dramatic departure from the position of the Obama administration when it comes to colleges and universities and affirmative action. Colleges and universities now have a green light to leave race out of admissions and enrollment decisions. The Trump administration dialing back Obama-era guidelines that encouraged universities to consider race as a way to boost college admissions diversity. The Justice Department called those guidelines unnecessary, outdated, inconsistent with existing law, or otherwise improper. Attorney General Jeff Sessions called the changes an effort to restore the rule of law. This move comes as President Trump considers who he'll nominate to replace Justice Anthony Kennedy on the Supreme Court. Kennedy has long been a swing vote on affirmative action decisions, joining the court's liberal justices on the issue. This issue is certainly going to come up before the Supreme Court again in the next few years. There's a case involving Harvard's affirmative action policy, a lawsuit filed that says the university discriminates against Asian students. Civil liberties groups called this announcement from the Trump administration an unfortunate set back. And we run the risk that we may see school officials going back to the drawing board, uh, revising their policies and changing their approach in ways that can be really harmful to us as a country. So what can American colleges do? They can keep their policies in place based on the Obama era guidelines. But if they do, they could put themselves at risk of action by the federal government, a lawsuit or a revoking of funding.